This is stock number 20J2. We are here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep headquarters. Today we are checking out the all new 2020 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon. This vehicle has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor, which pumps out 285 horsepower. Firecracker Red is the color. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it's like you're right here looking at the Jeep with me. And definitely your best way to check out the vehicle without actually being here, which we invite you to come in and on person to check out these Gladiators. This is the second one we've had. We've already sold the first one and uh, wanted to, didn't even have time to get a video of that, but I wanted to get a video up of this while we had the chance, actually somebody coming to look at this particular one later today. Um, but hopefully we'll get a little bit better idea of the overall condition or styling cues of the Gladiator and just what this particular one has on it. It is a Rubicon package, has Falcon, Wild Peak, 33 inch tires. These are LT 285 70 R17s and come with the 17 inch painted and polished aluminum rims. Of course, it has four wheel disc brakes, some good um, mud terrain tires on there. Has the 2.0 Fox shocks. And you can see everything underneath. Get a really good look at that. This one has the LED lighting group, so you get the LED running lights and the fenders there. You also get the LED running lights around the headlamps, the LED headlamps themselves, and the LED fog lamps. Has the red tow hooks. Now this is the uh, kind of the plastic composite front bumper. On here, the rear bumper is metal on this one. You get the cowl induction hood there, the black and red Rubicon lettering. This one has the color match fender flares, the wheel and bed rock rails on it as well for off-roading. You know, Jeep's touting this as the most capable off-road truck on the market, which it definitely is. If you know anything about Wranglers, they are the most off-road capable vehicle. Has the Black hard top, this is a three piece hard top. So those front two pieces come off and then this back one comes off in one piece. And basically everything from the doors right here forward is just like all the other Wranglers and then everything else from here back is the Gladiator. So you can see how that design is there. It's still really easy to get into the back seats on this. You'll notice that it has bed rail covers on it has the rock rails on the back of the box here. This is a metal bumper. You get the red tow hooks on the back. Comes with the towing package. So properly equipped, these trucks can pull up to 7,650 pounds. You get the four pin wiring, seven pin wiring right there as well. Has the LED tail lamps, locking tailgate. What I love about this tailgate is, I'll just open it and watch it'll come on down by itself. So it's not powered or anything, but it has a shock in there that doesn't allow it to slam down. You get LED bed lighting. There's a 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in back here. You have the cargo rail management system with the tie-down cleats. This is a five foot bed. Tailgate's really light, shuts really easily. Jeep really did their homework when it came to these trucks. Everything looks like it fits really nice, really capable. Tailgate opens nice, I mean, lots of room in the back of these as well, which we'll check on in just a second. This one has the advanced technology package, which gives you the blind spot monitoring. This one has heated mirrors, enter and go system. The Rubicon package gives you the black leather interior with the red stitching, the red Rubicon stitched into the backrest, driver's seat height adjuster, also has auto headlamps, 
factory floor mats. You can see it has the TFT display, outside temp compass display, you got your fuel. You also can do your digital speedometer here as well. Um, and all that good stuff. Comes with a heated leather wrap steering wheel, part of the cold weather group. Here's your adaptive cruise control. Also has forward collision warning, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and then on the back of the steering wheel is your audio controls. Also it has the tilt and telescopic steering wheel. So the steering wheel goes in and out. Has the 8.4 4C radio, which gives you a factory navigation, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. Also has Android Auto, Apple CarPlay capabilities, and this is where your HD camera shows up for your backup camera. Just really crisp, crisp, really clear. Um, they really did a nice job on those new backup cameras. You get the red dash on this particular one. You have all your normal climate controls. So, like like I said before, the front end of the vehicle is a lot like the current Wrangler um, JLs. I mean, it's it's almost identical. So. Every, all the controls are going to be the same if you have a Wrangler right now. It'll be easy to transition to this truck. It has an AUX USB and a USB-C. The power windows are still right there. This one has the front and rear um, locking differential or you can just lock the rears. Also has the off-road plus mode and the sway bar disconnect. You have your four auxiliary um, switches right there. The 4x4 shifter on the floor, the 8-speed automatic transmission. This one has the insulated hardtop, so you get these inserts in here. They help uh, keep it a little bit warmer in the winter and then also a little bit of noise dampening on the road. You have an SOS button right there. Um, you have your auto dimming mirror. You have your quick releases right there. You still have your latches up here to get those hardtop pieces off. Also you have your home link buttons right there as well. And uh, yeah, very similar to the current Wrangler JL up front, almost identical. Where we have all the changes is coming to the back here. This is your hardtop holder for those front pieces right here. Um, of course, it's going to have a sliding rear window. This is a manual slide, so you got to unlock it and then slide it manually, which is pretty easy. Has the built-in rear defrost. You get that hardtop insulation piece all the way across the back here. And then just a lot of leg room back here as well. It has the latch child safety systems. These headrests fold down. These seats also fold down. You got your top tether anchor for your latch system and then there is a bit of storage back here with a cargo nut as well. There's uh, the torque wrenches to, or the torque bolts to get the back hardtop piece off. And then these seats do fold up like so. So it kind of snaps into place. It's not going to fall down on you. And then you have a lockable storage bin underneath here. And you also have a spot for all your bolts for the hardtop pieces, which is right there. Nice little cover on there floor mats back here. There is a 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in, and then two USBs and two USB-C jacks back here. So, a lot of really cool stuff on the new Wrangler and this one in particular. Um, being the Rubicon, probably one of the most off-road capable vehicles on the planet. And uh, thanks for checking out the video. If you'd like to see um, more pictures of this particular Jeep, you can go to our website, which is www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from both of our locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. A link to more Jeep Wrangler videos like this one and Gladiator videos like this one on your right. If you've not been to our website on the bottom, link to this vehicle on our website, click those, check us out. And we really look forward to helping you with this brand new 2020 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon. Thanks again.